Get into a quiet place. Sit or lie down in a comfortable position. Slowly close your eyes. That's right, just close them. It's so easy. And as you do, focus on your breath. Create an image of yourself in a relaxing, beautiful place, which could be a place you've been to or one you've seen in a picture. Continuing to breathe in deeply, one, two, three, four, holding, then exhaling slowly, four, three, two, one. Each time you exhale, allow all of your stress, worry, and busy thoughts to exhale with each breath. Keeping up that pattern as you imagine yourself surrounded by your beautiful place. Continuing to breathe in, one, two, three, four. Holding, then exhaling again slowly. If any thoughts come in, gently guide them out. Bringing your focus back to your breath and your body. It's so easy just to relax and do nothing to get into this neutral place where you have awareness of your breath. Breathing in, one, two, three, four. Holding and exhaling, four, three, two, one. It might even feel like you're floating. And it feels so peaceful just to do nothing and allow all of your concerns to stay out of your awareness for now. As you continue focusing on your breath, you can allow yourself to become aware of your body, your brain, and your mind. Your mind is at ease. And now whatever you choose to focus on, you can easily give your full attention to for as long as you want to. And you're now able to focus on these words more and more with each breath. Remembering to breathe deeply, one, two, three, four, holding and exhale again. You find that it's easy for you to become aware of your body, every part of it, without even thinking about it. You're able to become aware of it now, gradually and easily. It's so natural. As you breathe deeply and comfortably, you can begin to allow your mind and your body to open to these words. Your mind is open to these words repeating them silently now with me. It is my intent to gain total control over how I spend my time. Every day, I'm getting more control over my actions and how I use my time, whether it's being on the phone, studying, working in a clear and focused way, relaxing, or whatever I'm doing, I choose to make the most of my time. I fully understand that time is valuable and limited, and for me to make the contributions I desire in this life, it's necessary for me to be in total control of how I spend my time. I notice when I'm wasting time, whether on my phone, on my computer or social media, or anything else that doesn't use my time efficiently, I naturally and easily step away from whatever I'm doing and focus on something more productive. It's easy for me to set a schedule for the time I spend on my phone and social media, and I'm motivated to do it, and I stay on the schedule every day because I desire to apply myself fully to my goals and dreams. And even though I might feel like I'm missing something, I now release that idea fully and instead, I naturally and easily draw new people, classes, events, and interesting things into my life that I find more engaging and meaningful than being on my phone and social media. I enjoy applying myself in a useful and positive manner toward these new things. Each day, I find myself using my phone less and less. And each day, I increasingly notice that the things on social media platforms are often boring, and I don't really need those things at all. If I need to be on social media for my job, I naturally and easily use it for that purpose only and can easily pull away or put down my phone or go out with friends 
or whatever else it is I wish to do instead of spending so much time on my phone and social media. I have total control over how I spend my time. Each day I feel my brain rewiring for more activities where I'm free of my phone, whether it's spending time with people, or playing sports, or working in a more productive way, or anything else in my life where I wish to apply myself more fully. I feel my brain rewiring, both physically and mentally, for more diverse stimulations that have nothing to do with my phone. And each day, I see more and more that I'm able to manage the time I spend on my phone and social media, and my life is becoming more balanced. I notice that I'm spending less time every day watching what other people are doing, and instead, I'm doing interesting and engaging things myself. It feels so much better to be living life rather than watching other people live it. And the more I use my time to do things that are productive and action-oriented, the better I feel emotionally and physically. Every day, I'm getting happier and more active. I know that there are many people just like me who would rather live life than be on their phones. And I naturally draw these people to me now. And it's easy to spend time with them because we don't need our phones to communicate or have fun or participate in whatever activities we wish to be doing. I feel total relief to be in charge of my time. It feels so good to have time to do the things I need without feeling like I have to know what everyone else is doing. It feels so good. And I just allow myself to experience that relief now. I align my entire body with my conscious mind. And I align my subconscious mind with my conscious mind. And when every part of me is in line and working toward the same goals, it's so much easier for me to get total control over my time. My mind, brain, and body are working together toward this goal, and I ask my body and every part of it to participate in my desire to spend less time on my phone and more time participating in life. And even though I may have spent too much time on my phone and social media in the past, I fully forgive myself for whatever caused me to make those decisions, either with or without my knowledge. I release all judgment toward myself and take the action of managing my time from this point forward. And I now allow my body and my subconscious mind to naturally release blocks and negative beliefs that have kept me from having total control over my phone and my time. I now release these blocks in a way that's gradual and peaceful for me and easy for me to handle. Each day I'm becoming more disciplined and I enjoy creating my dreams and goals and living fully. I trust the process. The more I listen to these words, the more discipline and focus I have with my time. It's easy for me to set aside time for my phone and social media and then when the time is up, I can put it down to live fully without worrying about my phone at all. I now take a moment to imagine myself living exactly as I'd like to, in total control of my time spent on the phone and social media. I feel my body rewiring and remembering exactly what it feels like to be in control. And it continues to rewire more each day in a way that guides me to the life I desire to live. And every time I listen to these words, I'm able to work more steadily toward the things I want to achieve without wavering. I continue to breathe deeply as I increase self-discipline, and in the future, from this day forward, every time I put down my phone, my body naturally remembers these words and I continue to get stronger in my desire to spend less time on my phone and instead live life to the fullest in whatever way that means to me. Breathing in again deeply. One, two, three, four. 
feeling gratitude for all that you've accomplished. Exhaling now, four, three, two, one, feeling peaceful. As I begin to count up from one to four, you feel the sensations returning to your body. You can start by moving your fingers, arms, toes, legs, feeling the energy come up through your body. Your full awareness is returning. One, feeling energized. Two, feeling powerful. Three, feeling focused and alert. And four, eyes open, feeling refreshed and grateful, ready to move into the day with energy and happiness, knowing that you have total control over how you spend your time and your phone and social media.